Welcome back. We are here working on our barn. I guess this is part two of my barn build. I'm trying a new barn. So I've got my flooring in and I've got the low wall in. So now I want to do the uppers or the second top. Second, second top? I don't know what that means. The, uh, the upper upper part of the walls is going to be this copper. We'll see how it looks. I'm not sure how it's going to look. I did try and pair it up with spruce because I think it goes better with spruce. This is a lot of copper. I'm not sure. The copper, those almost look like some kind of fruit. With a little green leaf. I guess it's supposed to be like little copper ingots or copper nuggets all packed together. But this is based on a barn that I saw while I was driving around. Oh, it's getting dark. Let me get some light and I can finish putting these walls in. Night comes so quickly on the server. Look, I didn't even have to be gone for a second. It took The amount of time it took me to run from here over to where my bed is, it's like right there where that tree is. These guys spawned. Which was really because I have... Uh, Go away, you spider. You're not going to attack me during the daytime. That's because I've got everything lit up so well that this is like one of the only spots that is not lit. We'll have to see how this looks. I may have to do some modification of it. It looks not as good as I think it is. should. But I based this, yeah, I saw a barn as I was driving around, and it had a big, long, rectangular centerpiece, and then it had kind of like these two wings uh, hanging off the side, these two, like, smaller additions. And I don't know what they're used for. I didn't go uh, knocking on the door and say, can I look in your barn to see how it's set up? So I'm going to have to kind of use my imagination for how a barn would be set up. I'd imagine the side, the areas off to the side could be like a tack room or something or storage for hay. And the way I'm doing it, especially if I put a door over on this end, because I think the doors are on either end. So I'm going to have one door on one end and then another door over on the other end. What is, oh, am I out? I'm out of blocks. Okay. I do have more of those. Let's see how this looks. Mm, I don't know how it looks. It's not horrendous. I think it's going to help if I put in like windows here. And maybe. Uh, like windows there. Maybe I can get enough uh, enough blocks so I don't have to go all the way back. And then maybe like if I do windows here. Maybe window there. I think with the windows, I'm going to go through and put like spruce shutters on the outside. Yeah, so like here, there. And that'll allow me to finish up because all I needed was this little spot there. Like 
that. Yeah, I think that'll work for that'll work for my windows. I want that to be bigger. Right there and then over here. something like that Yeah, so this will be the main barn door for the cows to go in and out. And then we'll have some cow stalls over here. The tack room you know, with the storage and hay storage and stuff over there. And then maybe a couple stalls or something on either side here for the main door. Yeah, not bad. That's 17. I wonder if... Manage? No, I don't think I'm going to be able to manage that whole thing. Yeah, because I'm going to need eight. So I'm going to use all my blocks just doing that. So we're going to change up. We're going to do spruce on the upper top. And that's just because I, I, was, I was going to do this all the way to the top. But I'm thinking it's going to be a little much. So I think it'll look better if I kind of have a just a section in the middle. And then the top part it will be a row of uh, spruce at the very top there. that now this here well spruce all through there and then this is going to peak right. I'll come through here and clear out we'll have a like a window or something in here it's going to be very tall and it's going to be invisible. Like that. And I have to decide what to do for the roof. I usually fall back on like cobblestone, but I'm not going to do cobblestone. I need something in the reddish or the orangish or the copperish look. Oh, I wonder, I may actually have, we'll have to check. I don't know if I've got that many. I'm thinking I may have extra copper left over from the uh, cathedral build because I had a lot of copper. I used a lot of copper, but I had a lot of copper I collected. That's where I got a lot of this. Uh, nuggets I used to make this. I went through and gathered a lot. There. Three, two, one. I hope you're and start to see what this is going to look like. And I think I said in the last episode, that's how I get a lot of, you get a lot of ideas if you just go through and keep your eyes open when you're just driving around and stuff. And then, you know, so see a building or something that looks interesting. You know, like, the real th thing is, it's not so much, oh, I'd like to build that. It's like, could I actually build that? That's that's where you get the fun stuff. It's like, 
see something where it's like, I don't know if I could build that, but I will try. And then you just put it together like I am doing. And that's good there. And actually, I think, I think I want. I think I want these walls to go up some more. I think this is where the roof is going to start, right here. Yeah, so the roof will slant up to here, and then it will peak from here all the way up. Go away, you invisible block. You are a pain. Yeah, and that will be much more impressive, too. This is going to be a big building. But it's not like I don't have the space to use. And then I can put a big loft up here, too. There we go. Yeah, so that this this is quite an impressive thing. It's bigger than that barn that's over there, or the stables over there. Here, up, 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 up. Okay, let me go through and finish this, and then we can start looking at the roof. Okay, so I've got some roofing materials, and I think we're going to go with this cobbled deep slate. But first, I was looking at this front, and this just looks way, way too big, or just too flat. I need something here. So I think what I'm going to do is... I do that. Oh, there we go. Sometimes it's hard to crouch. Like there. Oh, that's not. Oh, oh, that's not good. Oh, I can do this. There. Oh, oh, oh. I don't think I got enough lighting in there. Ah, I can't see anything anyhow. Dang it. Why did I wait till dark before I started back up? Okay, that, yeah, that looks much better. That was just way too big and flat. I am going to have to put a lot more mossy, 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 um, what's that, carpeting there. Let's go out three. Oh, no. I better go down and get that because I had to... Uh, I had to do a bit of digging to get the cobble. I realized I had no deep slate left. Oh, good thing I went down here. I had no deep slate in my inventories. Dang it. You would think after all this time I'd be a bit more organized going through here. You would think I'd never played this game before. 
What was I saying? Oh yeah, I didn't have any deep slate in my inventory. I was very surprised. Okay, yeah. Uh, I do have a deep slate mine underneath the city here, so. What's that? That is different. I'm going to have to think about what I'm doing there. Because the transition's not as smooth as I thought it was going to be. Oh, and I don't want this. I think what's called for here are some slabs. But I think that'll make a smoother transition. If I do, let's cobble slate. It's a cobble deep slate. Um, cobbled slabs. I'm going for the cobble because I want it to look rougher. Like this has a the cobblestone, so it's got a rougher look. I think the cobbled roof is going to give it a rougher look. And even the copper, it's kind of rough looking. Like it's got all those little pebbles of copper in there. Although if you look at it closely, it looks almost like berries or something. Here, let's do like that. I think I can just do a smooth transition with these slabs and kind of work the two sides together. Like there. So we do this. And that's non spawnable, so that's good. Like that. Look at all the snow down there. Oh, that is going to be converted into wheat. So that's not as bad as it looks. Oh, and I need to cut out a wall there. I think that gets us started on this roof. So let me go ahead and finish up, finish up the roof here, and then we can probably move on to the inside. I was going to say that finishes the roof, but I almost finished myself. Good thing I've got armor and feather falling and all that jazz. Although occasionally I forget if I'm not wearing it. And I'll just jump off something this high and then end up killing myself and go like, ooh, wonder what. I think this will work out good. This cobble uh, deep slate actually goes with the rest of the barn colors. See snow. I covered up all those with moss, so it doesn't seem to be snowing on any of those. There's one block I missed down there. And I need to go through and cover that up. So there's one over there too. And I need to go through the sheet pin. And actually, I need to fix... Look at that. I've got a few. I need to go through here and put mossy carpet on all those 
like that tree, that tree way out there on the other side of the stables. Maybe I can get some darker green carpeting and put over on top of the spruce. And then I need to put something on the edges of the roof there. I'm surprised something hasn't spawned. Well, probably not because I've got that lantern hanging right there. But um, I need to cover those up to get that. Oh, and then up there I need to put some brown carpeting or something. Boy, so I'm going to cut all those trees down. So we're good there. So that's, she's uh, lots of snow. I got a lot of snow through here I need to take care of. I need to do some edging on Put a cover on there. Oh, okay, so we're in a different biome here. So this is good. I like this. Rain. Rain is fine. I wish this rain would extend over there. But see what kind of biome we are in. Um, taiga. So this is a taiga. And then what happens if we get over here? We are in... Taiga, snowy taiga, taiga, snowy, <laughs> look at that one block there, taiga, snowy taiga, so this is all snowy taiga here, but except for this, this little spot here is taiga, is that just because there's a lantern there, no it's snowy taiga, it's right there, I thought it was just taiga, like see that's just taiga, that's snow, so that's why I got all the snow, oh, Another one on top there. Yeah, so I need to. Uh, so I'll have to do snow control over there, but thank goodness, no snow control over here. I like that. Except for right, yeah, look at this. You can just see that block. This one right here is snowy, and this one's not. So weird. So now we can move on to the interior. So I think like here, just gonna put like a small little corral here. Maybe with a, like a fence gate there. I don't know if like temporary storage for cows or what have you right there. those open I'm gonna put like a food thing here and this will be like a water trough so I can feed, fill that full of water this will be where the food goes so we can do the same thing here like that Let's see, I think I'm actually going to wall this off like that. Maybe there. So this will be a way in here. Ooh, I don't like the way that looks. Um, Why is it doing that? Maybe dang it. I think I'm gonna have to do this. There. Go on before I forget. Good. Put a couple doors there. I'll leave this open in the middle here. Because we are gonna stretch this all the way through here let's see so if i'm ooh, ooh, dark 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 um just temporarily i'm gonna put a torch here so if we come in we will want gates to be there Let's put two stalls at this end.
Ooh. Like that. Then I guess this would just be wide open area here. It doesn't need to be like too stalled up because there are not too many cows. The cows are just going to come in here and mole, mole about when the weather is bad. Oh, and I do. Oh, I want to put a loft in here. So let's see where that's going to go. Right here. So like these will be the stairs up. Um, I just need a temporary block. Okay, so this will be here. Okay, so this will be the loft area. So it's going to be at this level. It's like I intentionally did every other one. And it still didn't work out right. Um, let's see. I guess there. So that would be the loft. Get rid of this and then do that can be fine. Can I get through here? Okay, I think that'll work. I mean, it leaves a little gap there, but I, I, I believe that'll be okay. And then debating on me, run this wall up. right there so let's actually let's get rid of this and put a beam here This loft is kind of an add-on. I didn't really anticipate having a loft, so I'm sort of winging it as we go. But what's new? I'm usually winging most of the builds. Very rarely do I have like a final plan. I just have a, a vague idea that I'm trying to execute. Okay, that's not too low. And then for lighting, I think I'm going to do... Oops, like there. Will that light this back part? Yeah, that'll light the back part. I guess that means that. 
would have to be yeah, that would have to be the next one. Let's do this. Do I have enough? I got 22. That is not enough. Because I was thinking leaving this middle part open and covering the three ends or the three actually the four no the three because I'm not covering this one over here so I'll leave this open to the top well, actually no I think oh no maybe I will I think I will close in so I will close in all Four of these. Yeah, so I'll close in that one, that one, that one, that one. And we'll just add uh, like a little ledge here. there but I think so it's not the safest loft maybe I'll put some rails up here not spruce so I don't want spruce maybe oak maybe some oak rails up here and then yeah if I fill in this side and that's filling all these sides then I can put a couple beams up here it's too dark to see but I could put a couple beams here that way I can hang some lanterns so yeah, I added in a few lanterns here to light the outside and to make it look a little better. Um, I guess I can get rid of this torch and this torch here. Since I got those two lanterns there. And I'm not sure about the corner torch. I may need that still. But I can get rid of some of these torches. Because I'm going to like hang... few lanterns from there and then we get into the storeroom we got the roof on it now so we're just going to pile in some uh, let's see do, do, where's it there we go I'm gonna put this here because then I can get away with stacking it there leaving that hole there so I don't have to waste a bale of hay Well, this is fine. I'll put like a small stack of hay here and there. I'm going to have to grow some more wheat because I need some hay for my next build. Yeah, and just sort of stack, you know, like little bales of hay here. Put some barrels couple barrels here here we got a stack of barrels back there except yep see it's dark which is why I want to do this add a beam across the top and then just put a lantern on either side that should light up almost all of this oh and then finish this off those blocks sound a little funny like almost squishy Do our beam across here because it looks like something this wide would need support beams so that's actually makes sense too let's get rid of this 
Get rid of this. I'm definitely going to have to grow some more wheat. Because my next build needs, <laughs> it really needs some wheat. We'll just put a one there. Okay, I think, I think that, that is looking good. So we have our loft up here. Uh, it's dark back here, but I don't think there's any, yeah, no spawnable areas. So that's good. I thought about putting a rail, but eh, I'll wait until OSHA comes and finds me. If people uh, can't fall off of that, then, well, it's actually not that far to fall. So you'll, if I can fall off of it and not die, my workers should be fine. So these will be cow pens, so we can keep cows in them. Most of the cows are going to come through here. The lighting behind there really helps because I don't need any more torches through here. We have our pasture out here. I guess the only other thing I would do is maybe just uh, fire up a couple of these. Well, I do need to go through and add. Um, put the moss where, oops, let's get rid of this because I don't want anybody jumping out. Uh, put the moss where the snow is right now because I'm going to need, you know, like mossy, uh, mossy carpet. That's yeah, carpet. That's it. Mossy carpet on top of these and on all these little snow spots. But they should, they should keep the cows in. Another one here. So it's not so much a, a bare pasture as it is a little tree filled field there doesn't look half bad once I get the cows in I can just lock the doors and then they can have the room over there and the rest of it is all for us so finally got my barn done so oh maybe well, maybe moss up, so oh, not moss up, but I'm gonna fill in this over here. Oops, I'm trapped. Um, I almost want a tree here. I'm not sure about that. I'll have to think about that. And I don't think I got anything on this other side. There's really no room for a tree or anything through here. I will put a couple bushes in there because I think that actually, that'll help. But the barn is done. It actually came out kind of how I was picturing it. Not too bad. And actually the copper is not atrocious. It does add a kind of a difference in there. So it's not one big giant spruce box. Anyhow, that is it. Thank you for watching. I hope you're having or will have or are going to have a great day. And I will be back in the next episode. I have a actually plans for the next buildings. Not detailed plans. I've got mental plans. Uh, but I got a pig pins are going to go right here. Yeah, I think this whole strip right here is all going to be pig pin. So until next time. Take care and I'll see you later. Bye bye.